Hello and welcome back to Epic Food Food Review. Yeah. Anyway, in today's video, we're gonna be reviewing. Oh wait, you're new around here, aren't you? Because this is the first ever episode of Epic Food Review, and it probably won't be far off the last episode, considering this entire show has a budget of like 20 quid. But yeah, welcome to episode one of Epic Food Review. Roll intro. Yeah, yeah, roll it. Anyway, in today's episode of Epic Food Review, we're going to be reviewing the world famous McDonald's Halloween menu because it's almost Halloween and McDonald's, I guess, wants to release food for it. Everybody has been raving about the brand new McDonald's McRib and it hasn't been here since the 90s and all that sort of stuff. I don't really know that much, but yeah, basically, we're going to be providing an epic food review. Um, I'm probably not going to do this every single time. But yeah, basically, I'm going to be reviewing the McRib for this video. But your average fat guy who goes around the McDonald's drive through and does a review in his Ford Fiesta or Vauxhall Corsa if he's a bit of a chav or he's feeling on his Roadman era. Yeah, basically, we're going to be reviewing a McRib that isn't going to be just us sitting in a car and stuff because going to McDonald's is a bit shit. So why not go and get ourselves a free one by hunting the McRib? So I've chucked on my best camo outfit so the McRib cannot see me. Don't want it to strike. I've heard these things can be quite dangerous. I've got the camo, I've got the flashlight, the camera. So let's go ahead and find ourselves a McRib. So anyway, we're going to be basically searching for the McRib. Now, one of my best bets is they do tend to hide in some pretty interesting places so we might check up there a bit later on but for now let's have a look and see so we've got the shoe rack sometimes they hide inside the shoes and stuff but that doesn't seem to be the case today because I can't really see one up there so we're gonna have to go and see <clears throat> we might have to venture outside and see if we can find wait what's that oh, it seems to be a poop, a, a McRib poop. Oh yeah, that that is that is hundred percent. Onwards and upwards. So we're on a mission to find the McRib. <coughs> anyway, back to the mission on hand. Oh, 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 look, look at this! Look at this, guys! Look at this! More, more, more McRib poops. <coughs> Tastes shitty. Oh shit. What's, what's that? What's, what's that? What, what is that? What is that over there? It seems to be the, the McRib skin. It shed its skin. Fuck off, fucking chaffs. Need to sneak up on the McRib. Oh, damn it. It's not inside. It must be nearby. Shit, I'll blow my cover. Fuck, what is this over here? Is it? It could be a wild McRib. I have traveled so many miles to finally, finally eat one of these fuckers. Let's see how it tastes. Oh, yeah. Now that's... <coughs> now that is some prime ribs. If I do say so myself.
So I'm gonna get the wild McRib. Ten out of ten. Fucking solid. So yeah. Oh shit. The lights go out. Let's get back inside. I might I might fuck. I might shit myself. Fuck. This is so good. I might actually shit myself, bro. Oh shit. I'm back. Don't worry. We're we're all good. We're all inside. We need to find the dessert. The M&M McFlurry. And if we can hunt it, it may provide some much needed sustenance. Calories. Yes. We need to hunt it down. I have been crawling for miles and miles. Here it is. The deadly M and M McFlurry. Ah. It's, it's attacking me. Well, it seems to be it seems to be dead. Back to the studio. If we have a studio, fuck. Hello, and we have the light working again now, as you can tell. But yeah, I just killed this. I killed and captured and hunted. I hunted this M and M's McFlurry, and it has some very very cool little bats in it and pumpkins. It definitely looks like it has a lot of calories. Wow, let's have some more. Tastes like diabetes and a hint of coronary heart disease. This is probably gonna take like five years off my life. Oh well, fuck it. Tastes good anyway. Yeah. I got freeze brains. Anyway, thank you for watching Epic Food Review. If you if you hit the like button on this video, we might be back for an e another episode. Don't know what we're going to be reviewing, but we might do a, a sequel or something. As I said, the budget for this episode was like 20 quid. Probably not even that. But yeah, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and turn on the post notifications. We're trying to get to 100k subscribers on this YouTube channel as quickly as possible. And without further ado, let's go ahead and play the trailer for this week's big video. So yeah, play that trailer. In today's video, we're gonna be finding out if prime hydration is the most hydrating beverage that money can buy. We're gonna be testing prime hydration against water. The oldest and most natural form of hydration. 